This is a WECT Cape Fear Business Break. Hello, thanks for joining us. I'm Megan Donahue. With me today is Rick Stoker from First Fruit Ministries. Welcome, Rick. Thanks. Good to see you. You have an event coming up. Tell us about that. Okay. Megan, we have our annual, and this is our ninth annual, our annual golf tournament fundraiser for First Fruit Ministry. We feed a lot of people and do a lot for widows and individuals that are having it tough. So we're raising our fall funds at this tournament, and it's at Masonboro Country Club. It's on October 17th. We have lunch prepared for those who golf at 11. We tee off shotgun start at 12. It's 125 to play, and a foursome is uh, 450, a little discount there, and that includes lunch, uh, snacks on the way to play, on the course, sodas, beverages, uh, food, music, et you cetera, et cetera. It. Yeah, we're having a good time. We've really got the kinks worked out this thing, and we're having a blast. Great. Now, it's important that you raise money at this event because you do so much for our community. Tell us what this money's going to. Well, we work with widows on the weekend. We do everything from brush their hair to feed them. So we have teams that go out and feed them. We have interns. We have staff that go out. We have a food pantry open three days a week, give out thousands and thousands and thousands of boxes of food a year to the less fortunate. We're in the streets two to three nights a week and working with homeless people and children. I mean, there's homeless families. So, and we also have that at our, our facility. We house families and we house individuals. So a lot this money can do. Okay, how long has First Fruit Ministries been operating? About 15 years. Wow, that's a long time. Yep. Well, um, just to remind folks, the event's on October 17th. Okay. It's at 11 o'clock, Put for the Poor. And you can find out more by going to firstfruitministries.org. This has been a WECT Cape Fear Business Break.